guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to shuffle. I'm going to show you four easy steps that I think is essential for shuffling, or at least I use these steps a lot when I shuffle. Uh, so we are going to start with Running Man, uh, which is the most essential uh, shuffling use it in like every shuffle that is the most important that's why we are starting with that one also know that you can go back and forth in the video whilst um like you can pause the video go backwards and look through it again if you don't really understand so that's what i usually do when i'm practicing the dances but yeah let's get started You're starting with uh, a left, wait, yeah, left leg forward, like in front, and right leg behind. And now you're going to drag this one against the floor, backwards, and this one you're putting up in the air. I'm gonna show you so you understand, like this. So you put this one up in the air, drag this against the floor, uh, backwards. Let's try it again. Yeah, and one more time. Okay, so when you are here, you are going to bring this one back, even more backwards, and this forward. So you step out with this one, and you step back with this one, and still drag it against the floor, like this. Okay? And now we do the same thing with the other leg. So drag it and up with the other leg and then this one forward, this one back like this but now we try it again back and up back and down back and up back and down now we try it a little bit faster and not much faster so don't worry but if you feel like I'm going too fast, you can pause the video and try these steps again. So, and like this. Up and back and front and down. Up and back and front and down. Okay, let's try it a few times so you get it in your system how to do it. Okay, now we'll try it a little bit faster. So it's the same movement, but you move a little bit faster with every step. And if you have a hard time with that, move slower. Now we're going to try to do it really fast. So uh, I'm going to put on music and can shuffle to it. Okay, I'm gonna just show you from the behind so you can follow along. Okay, the next 
step that I'm going to show you is the tea step. So first I'm going to show you what it is and then the tutorial. So for this one, you want to start with uh, practicing with this one of the tools, whatever feels more comfortable. And then you're going to start with just moving it around. Start with just moving it however you want, however you like, because that's you need the comfort of the foot that you are moving with. Uh, yeah, we are going to start with just moving the heel up and to the side, like this, and then moving the toe to the same side, like this, and still just hold up this leg all the time to start off with. And then again to the side, to the side, to the side, okay, do this till, and then you can do it to the other side. So heel, toe, heel, toe, heel, toe. Because I'm worse at this one, we are going to practice that one too. Okay, so heel, toe, heel, toe, heel. Toe, heel, toe. Okay, so do that a few times so you get it in. <laughs> but now we are going to put in the other leg. So always when the heel goes down or goes up that way, that direction, you're putting down your toe on the, the other leg, like this. And then when you go up and with your toe in front, uh, then you go up with the other leg, like this. And then the same th thing, when you put down the heel, put down the toe. Okay, you don't have to do it this fast first. <laughs> I just get too excited. Okay, so I'm going to show you it from the behind so you can follow with me. So, up with this one, down, up, down, up, down, up. <laughs> But we 
are going to start with having both feet like this, okay? Then you put this leg, the right leg, over the left or which one you just prefer, like this, those uh, pointing at the wall to that side, to the right side, and heel goes uh, to the other side. Yeah. So then you want to lift up on your toe, go to the right with your heel and go back. That's the first thing you have to practice on to get that in. So just like this. Do it slow to fast. And then when you have that in, we are going to put uh, both legs in this movement, but the other leg, when this does this, this one goes out, the heel, both heel goes out, and then goes in, out, in, like this. And you should always step on your toes when you do this movement, like this. Because that's the movement when you see, like this, you go on your toes. So just go like this. Practice like this, like a ballerina. <laughs> I don't know if they, they do this, but when you feel like you got it, we go back to this beginning position. Bring this leg forward like this, but slowly. I'm going to show you how. So this leg is going out. This had the same movement as before, so this, you know. And then this one is going out and stepping forward like this one is now, so the heel to the toe. Yeah, so this one is going up, the heel is landing towards the toe and the foot is pointing at the left direction. So let's try it. So up, like this, this goes out and I can hold the balance because you're doing this fast later on. And then step down, this one goes back as it was, like the one you practiced before, this. And this one, as I told you, the heel points to the toe and the other toe to the other direction. Okay, so the other leg goes out and land. And the same thing, the other leg again and land. So we go back, start here, put this one over. Wait, yeah. <laughs> then up. And up, up, and up, up, and up, I care about. So, let's do this a few times, and then we are going to do it backwards, and it's the same movement going back, but I'm going to show you. But practice this for a little while first. I'm going to show you from here too. call this one a ballerina step because I feel like a ballerina when I do this. It's a little bit funny. And I do this with my arms because it helps. But you can have your arms wherever you want. You can try to do it faster when you feel comfortable. Okay, we are going to do it backwards now. It's the same movement. Have this one like this. And then, but you're moving the forward foot back because you can't move this one back a new fall. So this one is going back this time, not that. Yeah, you're doing the same movement, but the leg is going back instead of this going forward. So as you can see, always toe to heel, toe to the wall. So you can start doing it faster, you can incorporate them when you feel like you are comfortable with that.
the last one and I don't know what to call it. I called it like backwards running man because it's like running man but backwards. So let's show you what it is and then how to do it. When you do it fast, it's easier, I think. Or it's not easier, but it's, it feels like it's like a little bit different from when you do it slowly. Okay, so now we try to do it a little bit faster. And practice these steps a few times before you do it faster. So you can also just learn one thing today, the next day, another. You can split it up however you want and like. And now we are going to put all of these steps together in the order that we have learned them. And like five of each. watching videos I learned from myself that's usually how I do it uh, I just watch how people do it fast and try it out a couple of times and then I learn if you learned something from this video or liked it subscribe to me and like this video because it would help me a lot and I'm coming out with a workout shuffle video and it's, I'm using these steps that I have taught you today in that workout video. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope it was helpful. 
and we'll see each other in next video or i won't see you but you will see me thank you bye